Hi guys, <clears throat> Mooch here, uh, coming to you with another gun video. And uh, on today's uh, video, we're going to discuss the Smith & Wesson Model 40 uh, Lemon Squeezer. Uh, this is a 38 caliber J-frame with an inch and 7 8 barrel. Uh, the weight on this gun is 21 ounces. And it's a full weight gun. Uh, it's a very nice feel to it. Um, it uh, has a pistol grip safety that you actually have to grip the 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 uh, the safety in order to actually fire the weapon. The first thing I'll do is show you that uh, the gun is, uh, of course, empty. Uh, you've heard me say on uh, any gun video that I've ever done, I'm sure you already know, um, safety is just paramount. You want to make sure that any gun that you're handling is unloaded, especially if you're going to uh, you know, maintain it or, or clean it, field strip it in any kind of way. So you always want to make sure that it's it's safe. Um, anyway, this is uh, it's a nice little uh, carry and conceal weapon. Uh, I really like the, the solid wood handles, maple handles. Um, it's just a really good, uh, smooth uh, gun as far as the action is concerned. Um, it's just a lot of fun. Uh, just recently, I, I purchased one for my wife. I bought for her the, uh, the Model 642. Um, actually has the the rubber grip and it also has a built-in uh, laser in the grip um, for myself I like this particular style of a gun um, for years I wanted one of these and it just never could uh, no pun intended but pull the trigger on purchasing these things uh, this this particular weapon uh, retails for about nine hundred dollars uh, right now you actually can't even get one the only one you can get even similar to this is a is in the nickel uh, not plated, not the not the blued barrel. So um, I really don't care much for that one myself. And, and when I'm carrying a gun, it's not for flash; it's for self protection. So you know, I, I just like the old classic style um, myself. But uh, anyway, again, uh, Smith and Wesson Model 40 Lemon Squeezer. Uh, really sweet little handgun. Um, now before I wrap it up, I'll share with you that uh, what I carry in this gun is the um, it's 180 grain XTP uh, load these myself I use about 5.1 grain of uh, 231 powder um, it's a great load uh, it's, a, it's a pretty hot load it's not uh, you know if you're just going to use a round nose bullet you're probably going to use 231 but you're, you're only going to drop down to maybe 3.7 grain uh, this one I use uh, 5 to 5.1 the maximum is a 5.7 uh, I don't usually put the, the maximum load in there. It's just not necessary. Of course, for self-protection, you always want to use the, the hollow point. The uh, main point behind that is that um, if it's a smooth, round nose projectile, then, of course, it could go through the perpetrator and into um, some innocent bystander in the background, whereas with the hollow point, it's going to stay in whoever you hit. Um, I, I like that round. It's a much safer round. Um, of course, you know, as many of you know, uh, most of your uh, police officers and, uh, you know, they're going to use a, a, a hollow point tip for the very same reason, just to protect the innocent bystander in the background. Um, so I uh, just want to throw out there one more time, be safe. Uh, I hope to like this video. I hope you like the, uh, the gun itself. And um, as always, like this video and subscribe to the channel and we'll see you soon. Uh, cheap chisel mooch. Peace out.